In other news tonight, IPL warning customers about scammers who are demanding money and threatening to shut off the power. 24 Hour News Aids Tim McNicholas is live at IPL's downtown headquarters. Tim, uh, what are you learning about this scam? Well, Phil, IPL says the scams come and go throughout the year, and workers noticed a significant increase in the number of scam reports today. The company took to Twitter, warning customers that somebody is calling, demanding money, and uh, they are threatening to shut off the power for these customers. They're demanding money, by the way, immediate payments through a prepaid debit card. Jason Strachman of Lawrence says he didn't recognize the number, but the caller knew his name and address. They said he owed money and they threatened to shut off his power. He got frustrated, hung up, looked up IPL's number himself, and the real IPL worker told him he just avoided a scam. It, it was it was freaky and scary because they they knew so much about me without me having to provide them any information, and that's where it sounded so legitimate. The biggest red flag that customers should be aware of is that uh, demand of immediate payment. Uh, we will never demand that over the phone. So Strackman says the scammer gave him a number to call for more information. I called it. I heard an automated message saying I'd reached IPL. I pressed five to talk to a real person. Then I asked, are you a scammer? They said, you decide yourself, and that's when I was disconnected. We also left a message with the IMPD asking if they are investigated. We have not, if they are investigating this, and we have not heard back at this time. IPL says they are working with the police, and they encourage customers to report these scams, uh, not just to them, but also to their local police department. Live downtown, I'm Tim McNicholas, 24-Hour News 8. Good to know, Tim. Thank you. Happy